every now and then I stare at the wall and say, I don't know what to add to the video game ball. So I enlist the help of you internet guys to make the decision for me. In the last wave of suggestions from you, only one game was brought up twice. Quackshot. As in the Sega-developed, Sega-exclusive Disney platformer starring Donald Duck? Yeah, we'll add that to the vault. Thanks to Gilberto Martinez and Frank Hagar. You know what this game's called in Japan? I love Donald Duck, Garuzia... Oh, no, you know, what a coincidence, Japan. I also love Donald Duck. And I also love this game because Quackshot is a pretty solid platformer. On your quest to find hidden treasure or whatever the excuse for traveling the world is, you'll find that your infinite supply of plungers is your primary weapon. You can upgrade them to serve as instant platforms on any wall or ceiling, which is kind of the game's main hook. I like it. It's clever. Alternatively, since your plungers only stun your enemies, you can shoot popcorn for a spread shot or even bubbles, which can one-shot kill most enemies and even break through walls. Bubbles are your most deadly weapon. Bubbles. 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 You know how words start to sound weird the more you say them? Bubbles. Bubbles. For a game that lets you select your level, it's actually pretty linear. You can only go so far in a level before needing an item from one of the others to continue progressing. It sounds annoying, it isn't. Donald has the courtesy to drop a little checkpoint for you to land at the next time you select that level, so you don't have to get destroyed by snake charmers every single time you visit Egypt. Wait, is that Ka from the Jungle Book? By the way, have you ever eaten so many jalapeno peppers that you got pissed off? Oh, Donald has! Do not, I repeat, do not give this bird spicy food. More people have died that way than from anything else in this game. Feeding him other birds is totally okay. In fact, it fully restores his health. I'm trying to figure out what that is. is it chicken or turkey, quail, duck? That kind of goes in a dark direction. Uh, I don't even want to touch that one. Eh, forget it, I'm touching it. Cannibalism may be a thing Quackshot rewards you for. With unlimited continues and a health bar that large, Quackshot's not the most difficult platformer in the business. But like I said, it's solid, it's well-made, and for the anti-Nintendo fanboy of the 90s, was viable enough ammo for being a Genesis owner. Oh.